Welcome back, 822. 800,000 lights filling Woodland Park Zoo, which is one of many reasons Wildlight has made it onto Ellen's favorite things list. Yeah, you can walk through this place. You can visit some of the uh, animal residents there. You can even go inside the bear's den for tasty treats, as long as you're not that tasty treat. Let's check in with <laughs> Ellen Taylor live at the zoo, <laughs> showing us uh, what we can enjoy out there. The lights are a great show there at the zoo. Yeah. And you know what, Bill, I promise you will not be a tasty treat in the bear's oh, den. Uh, that is the new uh, 21 and up little section we'll be showing you next hour. But first and foremost, I want to introduce you to Erica Baker and the star of this morning. This is Skyana the porcupine. So when you come out to Wild Lights and you take a walk to this beautiful sea of lights, uh, your ticket helps, you know, take care of these animals. Erica, how old is Skyana? Skyana is five years old. She was born in April 2014 right here at Woodland Park Zoo. And I, she just looks so peaceful eating. She reminds me of me. <laughs> just as long as I'm eating, I'm totally good. Um, how long do porcupines usually live for? So in the wild, they can live up to around 15 years, but in animals, or human care, excuse me, they can live over 20. Okay, you mentioned out in the wild, mm -hmm. right? And so notice what Erica just said, which is Skyana can live for longer in, I don't want to say captivity, under human care, right? Yes. Um, then she can out in the wild. And you know, there are people watching when we do segments on zoos, they're like, oh my God, just let all of these animals out into the wild. That's where they belong. What do you say to that? Because I would imagine you get that that question too, right? That is true, yes. Well, Skyana specifically, she was born here, like I said, at Woodland Park. So she is very comfortable around hu people. She seeks out human attention, which is why sure. she's such a great ambassador. Um, but that would actually be really, you know, a negative effect on her in the wild and it would not set her up for success so she would not do very well out in the wild so read between the lines it wouldn't set her up for success out in the wild um so when we say ambassador animal i mean obviously we can't ever really get this close to porcupines like how close can i get to skyana can um, i feed her you can she's actually in the middle of um, one of her favorite oh. treats right now which is a leaf eater biscuit but as soon as she is done with that one you are welcome to give her a nice tasty all treat. right i can't wait for that so again when you come and check out wild lights your ticket price goes to help out animals like Skyana. It runs through January 5th. Coming up next hour, we're going to take you inside the bear's den. Not literally the bear's den. It's even better because there's actually food there for us to eat. Guys, back on over to you. Ellen, thank you. <laughs> and hopefully they, they've removed the bears. Right. Yeah. That was